One of the really cool things that we've done with this kit, the Iga Slider 1080B kit, a motorized kit I should say, is that we've utilized basically all of our Actobotics parts. Um, what that basically means is that any of our Actobotics parts now will bolt to whatever, whatever you, however, whatever your application is for for uh, videography or whatever you're needing to slide back and forth. So the the um, the options are basically endless, whether or not you want to mount wheels or tracks or or uh, any type of rotational uh, axis onto your slider. You can easily do that by attaching channel or tubing. And I'm just going to show you one example of one thing you can do uh, just to kind of maybe get some ideas flowing. Basically, you can see here on the end of our end plates, you can see we incorporate our 770 pattern in the ABS end plates. Basically, in the distance right here from over here um, is basically the same distance on channel. So let's say, for example, you want to mount wheels to your slider, or you want to uh, mount something that comes off the end, coming up off the end, that has maybe a light or a spotlight that maybe spotlight comes on, maybe you put another switch mount over on this side and you want, when this comes back, it hits the switch and you have a spotlight up here and you need some channel. You know, you could bolt channel to the end, you could lengthen it out, you could bolt it this way, any particular way, you can also bolt it directly on the end and I'm gonna show you that real quick. Um, so basically, we've got some round stainless steel screw plates, and we're going to go ahead and bolt this onto the end. So we can come in right here. Actually, it'd probably be easier if I flip this whole thing over, just like so. So now we can obviously all adjust. We're going to just put it right in the middle here. Well, I think that's probably probably closer to the middle there. Come in with our screw plate, and that's one of the cool things about. Anything that we try to design in our kits is that you know you've got a lot of choices out there for sliders, um, high-end sliders, and video equipment. But what we try to do is give you the versatility to change anything that you purchase from us. Um, that's that's how we like to tinker around with things, and that's kind of what our belief is. So you know you never buy something that's just absolutely set set in its ways. You can modify it and change it around and everything's plug and play. So you're not having to hack this or cut this or or uh, uh, do that type of stuff. So um, and also it allows you to, you know, if you're the type that wants to go out and build your own equipment or, or add different features to your slider or whatever you're trying to do, Actobotics allows you to do that very easily and professionally. Um, you know, our main goal is to, as you can, our tagline on Actobotics is that, you know, it's a ball bearing precision building system, which is exactly what it is. We don't have bushings. Um, we use precision shafting. And what that does allows you to build very, very precise devices. Um, so there you go. Now we've got this piece of channel bolted to the end of your slider. Now, what you might use this for, who knows? You can run bolt wheels through here. You can bolt our motors through. You can have off-road tires. You could build a pivot point. So now the end of your slider here is fixed, yet this thing will pivot around in a one big circle, um, which you could get some really cool shots by doing that, especially on time-lapse photography. Um, so, but anyway, and your system can still slide up. It will not hit your channel. It will hit your stop right here. So the, the options are really, really endless. Um, you could have a slider on another slider. So really the possibilities are, are vast, but we just want to show you a quick example of what you can do and how we build versatility to even into this uh, motorized slider kit.